Okay guys, here we are at the assisted chin dip machine. Um, great piece of equipment uh, for those of you that struggle to do assisted, uh, or, or sorry, um, body weight chin ups or dips, which let's face it is most of us. Um, great opportunity to do exactly that uh, and be able to achieve reps here with assistance. The number one thing you need to understand with this one, the more weight you put on this, the easier it is. So this is weight of assistance, not weight of resistance, like all of the other machines in the gym. So if I've got, I've got 50 kilos on there, that's 50 kilos less my body weight that I'm lifting, okay? Um, so important to understand, the more weight you have on there, the easier this is for you. Now, in the wider position where these handles are sat right now, that's where I'd have this machine as a general rule for chin-ups, I'd get the handles right out of the way. If we're gonna do dips, I might bring the handles in a little closer. You can definitely do dips from the wider uh, position. Um, that's a personal preference. Okay, so with this one, we're gonna do the, uh, the chin up first. We're gonna use the neutral grip today. Again, like the um, lat pull down, the neutral grip, you should find you're a little stronger, you're able to, uh, to complete the exercise with more ease, which is a great place to start, particularly if you're new to the exercise. So, what we're gonna do is use the, uh, the steps here. Um, there's one step higher than the other. However you can get on is, is um, well, the easiest way is good, okay? So one knee on, ease your weight down. Your knees are gonna to be to the back of the pad with this one. Want to pull yourself up so your hands are in line, or your eyes, sorry, are just above your hands, and all the way back down. We do want full extension with this one. The upper body position is fixed and we maintain the neutral spine. What you'll sometimes see if the weight's too light, people doing this, I'm sorry, if the weight's too heavy, they don't have enough assistance, we, we want to avoid that wherever possible. Maintaining nice upright position in our upper body. Okay, dismounting on the assisted chin can be difficult, because um, what happens is, really common that when we get to the bottom of the range, we want to step off. Now, if we step off from here, this weight's going to fly up at 100 miles an hour. It's going to be really scary. Um, what we want to make sure that we do is we dismount right at the top of the range. Just ease that weight up, and then you can hop down from there. Quite straightforward. Um, the dip works in exactly the same way. Okay, so we're going to use these handles. We're going to have our knees towards the back of the pad. Again, we'll use our chin-up handles to help us get onto the machine. We'll weigh the weight down. We'll adjust our knees so that towards the back of the pad. We're going to be nice and upright. We're going to achieve 90 degrees at the elbow. We're going to press straight down and straight back up. To dismount to the top of the range of motion, ease the pad up, and you can hop off from there. That's the assistant chin dip, chin dip machine. Good job.